You are a free, fearless, beautiful bride. You are my cutest bean, my sweetest peach, my travel buddy, and my best friend. I've known you were the one since our eight hour phone calls, trusting me with your life when we went rock climbing, spending a week with me in Vermont, and watching Marvel movies and all the YouTube video breakdowns. <laughs> we are here now, and everything is as perfect as you. As your husband, I vow to remind you how perfect you truly are. I promise to protect your heart. As your king, I am committed to making sure that you always feel like a queen. To feel safe and appreciated, heard, loved, courageous, and beautiful. I'm excited for our unwritten stories we have yet to tell. There's so much I want you to know, but for now, I want you to know this. I love you in every universe. I love you 3,000. I love you for all time, always. I love you to the end of the line, kid. Do you remember me telling you about how I grew up without ever really having a best friend? I always felt incomplete or out of place in other friendships and relationships, but I've never felt that way with you. And now I know it's because you are my best friend and I just hadn't found you yet. Being with you puts my soul at ease, and I am endlessly grateful for that. My favorite moments with you are not the huge, grand, planned out moments. Those are great. But they're the ones where we are just us. Driving around, looking at houses, and dreaming of what ours will look like. The silliness and giggle fits in the kitchen and you galloping up and down the hallway. <laughs> I commit to working through the breakdowns. I commit to being open to give and receive feedback. I commit to growing and transforming with and for you and us. I commit to fun in all the ways. Will you say our contract with me? We, we are, are a free, free courageous, courageous, grateful championship couple. I'll go anywhere with you in the sunlight. welcome you here on this gorgeous day to this place where dreams really do come true. Let the radiant light of Vince and Lindsay's love shine on all of those around them. And today we celebrate you becoming one entity, yet still two individuals committed to each other, creating and writing the story of your life together. Those stories that are like the, the meant to be stuff, you know, the things that show up in synchronicity between a couple started really early with Vincent and Lindsay. Vincent and Lindsay, with so much joy, so much joy, I now send you out into the world to spread the beautiful light that you share with those around you. And I do so with a quote from the man who envisioned the space we're standing on now. Walt Disney said, laughter is timeless. Imagination has no age, and dreams are forever.
may you live happily ever after. By the power vested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife and introduce all of you to, and the world, <laughs> to Vincent and Lindsay Dangerfield. <laughs> Over the years, Lindsay has been my early 2000s fashion idol, my arch enemy, my greatest advocate, the biggest pain in my side, the Elsa to my Anna, but most importantly, she has been my hero. In all seriousness though, as most sibling relationships go, we may not always see eye to eye, but she is the person I can always count on and is someone I truly cherish having in my life. He brings out her goofy side that only the lucky few get to see. He makes her light shine brightest and genuinely loves Disney almost as much as Lindsay, which I find quite impressive. It's safe to say it didn't take long for us to realize that we were going to be best friends. And Lindsay, thank you so much for everything you've taught me these past few years and for being who you are. Most importantly, in allowing me to have the privilege to be here today with you. Um, as the best friend, you pray that she'll find a godly man who is loyal, supportive, respectful, and someone that, who will be there through it all. And I can honestly say that she found that in Vinny. I've watched the both of you grow as individuals, but also as a couple, and I know that you're a perfect match. As the two of you embark on your whole new world, just remember that the best marriage takes faith, trust, and a little pixie dust too. Once upon a dream, you both wish that you'd find your happily ever after. Well, we know if you keep believing a dream that you wish will come true, and it did. I first, I first met Vinny and Lindsay at the Legacy Retirement Group Christmas party. Um, my wife Kelly had been hyping them up for a while now, so I was really excited to meet you guys. And after getting to know each and you, every one of you guys, um, you quickly lived up to the hype. You guys were kind, loving, overall just good people. We had a great time. Um, and I'll leave you with this a quote from the wise Olaf. <laughs> um, find someone that is worth melting for, and I think Vinny found that in Lindsay for sure. And Lindsay, you found that in Vinny, so. All we would do is just talk, and just talk and talk about everything, and it's just fun being, you know, in each other's presence. And one morning, um, he was talking about uh, Lindsay and you know as this girl and all positive things and I really want to like go out with her and you know I'm thinking just how crazy he was about her and next time that I saw him I was like how'd it go the first words out of his mouth were I'm gonna marry that woman with Lindsay it was just like this is a hundred percent what I want to do like this time I'm gonna marry her and it was just a certainty that I've never seen from him before